Hey everybody, Jeremy with Family Adventures Overlanding again, and we're going to do a quick video on how to properly clean your scuttle. So you've made your dinner, this is the mess that you have left over, and obviously the scuttle's cooled down now because you're not going to clean your scuttle right after you, you make it. You're going to eat first, right? So we're going to go through this real quick. I'm going to light the scuttle here, turn the heat up, I'll let this get up to temperature. And I've got, oh, about a half a glass, half a cup of water here. Just pour that on your scottle like that. We're going to let that come to a boil. As you can see, it doesn't take very long for it to come to a boil. Usually what we do is just swirl it around a little bit. It does a pretty good job of breaking the crust that's on the, on the face of the scottle. If you have any bits of food or anything like that, usually what we do is just pull it up off to the side here. A little bit easier to grab with a paper towel. Essentially what you're doing here is you're steam cleaning the surface. At this point, the scottle is pretty much clean. So what I'm going to do is wipe the outer rim here. I'm going to take the uh, bits of food off that I brought up to that edge. Just capture those from the trash can. And then we just take a paper towel. You can actually just let this run until it boils all the water off. Put a little bit too much water on it. So we're just going to wipe it here real quick. Turn this heat off. Just like this. And then the very last thing you want to do before you completely put it away is just take a little bit of oil, put it right here in the center, and then take your paper towel and just wipe down the scuttle. And that puts that nice little sheen back on it. And as the scottle cools down, it soaks the oil back into the pores of the metal. And you won't have to worry about reseasoning your scottle then again for a while. And there you go. That is the proper way to clean a Tembo Tusk scottle. 